So we have me and then Debra. She's on vocals. We have David, who's on keys. We have Pops, who's on bass. Laura, who's on Weedo. Gabby, on multi percussion. Brian, on drums. Eric, on guitar. Uh, the first time, I thought that I like knew everything, and I thought that I was gonna like woo everyone's hearts. I'm no longer really trying to prove that I'm a certain type of artist, and I'm more trying to be like, you know, I wanna express what is me, and what is our band, and what is our story. I thought I was like awesome, and then I had like an artistic breakdown, and I realized, like, dude, like you just, you're like putting up an act, like who are you? Especially with Ramirez, I'm a Ramirez. There's a lot of pride in what that is, being a Ramirez and being a man and everything. And um, they are just like that machista stereotype. I, I would say like my dad's generation. And that's kind of like where I started kind of taking that in and putting it in part of my, like my artistry, like the looks and like the cowboy hats and things like that because I was like, you know what, I never thought I was man enough to, to look like that or wear that. And I'm like, but damn, like it looks good and it makes me feel good and it's like my culture. So I think for me, what is me is that I've, I've really owned the fact that you know, I'm Tejano and I grew up on a border, but I'm also like fabulous. And I love being kind of like that flamboyant type and, and showing people like, the reason why I do this music and the reason why I do this dress this way is because these are my influences and this is me telling you the story of my culture. And so 27 was hard. I want to express my culture and do it in a way that's me. And so I felt like there was like a pressure for me to do that before a certain age. Otherwise, I was going to be mediocre. I have, was going to have no talent. And so I just had this breakdown where I was literally on the phone with my mom crying and saying, I hate music and I just want to get out of this. And she was like, you're crazy. You need to like calm down. And so I just, from that moment, I realized like, you know, that there was other things that I could do and other ways I could express myself. And music was, was still going, like it was still going and it's never stopped. So now I'm here and I feel like, okay, I think we're getting to a really cool spot and I'm really excited to see what's gonna happen.